Welcome back to a little dead Corvette. A while back, we put a distributor in this thing and my friend called me up. He said the car started up and ran a little while and it crapped out. He pushed it back into the garage and we come to take a look at what, could, what the hell's wrong with it. And it's something that I never saw before, but I gotta show you guys what it is. He said the car is getting gas. Seems like it's not getting spark for some reason, so come in here and crank it. Tax moving, that's a good sign. We pulled the spark plug lead off, threw a spark plug on it, and it's getting no spark. So that's weird, because we have a signal coming from the tack, running the tachometer, but nothing coming out over here. Let's take a peek under the cap. Well, the good news is there's no oil in here. That's why we swapped the distributor out the last time, but center of the rotor is missing. Where the hell did it go? I got to pull the uh, rotor off here and see if all the parts are underneath it. This is crazy. Yeah, stuff got a little chewed up in here, but not bad. All the electrodes look okay. We picked out all the pieces, blew out what was in there. Now we'll uh, put a rotor on there and hopefully it'll fire up. Let's see if we could put Humpty Dumpty back together again. A little blue plastic thing just came off and allowed everything to fly apart. Put on a used rotor we had lying around. Aha! Oh, I gotta put it on. Oh, idiots. Yeah. Let's put the puck. Running on seven cylinders because we're jackasses. All right, one more time. <laughs> Unbelievable. Rotational forces were exceeded. Piece of crap. Where the hell was this thing made? I've never seen a rotor break like that. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And thank you for watching. Hmm. Which one do we want to ride in? Give me a boost.